So in this video, I want to go over to the um, K to F and F to K commands. So that's knobs to file and file to knobs. So as I said before, the knobs are kind of an ephemeral thing. They uh, they don't they're not permanently stored. Uh, presets and profiles overwrite them every time you change the preset or profile. So, but we can use uh, the knobs as kind of a temporary storage to try out presets and to save presets that we might be editing. So let's do a file to knobs. F2K. So what we're going to do is upload a file to the knobs. So we have to tell it where the file is. And it's in the all directory. And let's say clarinet. Okay. So now it says it uploaded the preset file that's in the all directory, clarinet DLP to the knobs. Now if I played the the DLF, it would play the clarinet voice right now. Right? So that's kind of one way to, you know, trial um, preset files or profile files if you use the, let's say if I wanted to trial a profile file uh, three say, say I wanted to I'd have to use the pro flag then and that would upload the profile file to my profile knobs uh, I'm not going to do it because I don't want to mess things up at the moment but that's how you would try out different uh, profiles System profiles on your DLEV without overwriting any slots or, or things like that. So it's kind of a handy kind of a trial thing. We can also grab the knobs that are currently on the DLEV, either the preset knobs or the profile knobs, um, and save them to a file. Say you're editing um, a preset and you want to save it kind of an intermediate kind of uh, point so that you can edit it further play around with it without and, and still be able to go back to the old older previous settings um, you could save it to a file so the way you would do that would be uh, k to f and you have to specify a file and let's say like my preset or something right so it downloaded the preset knobs to preset file my preset dlp and if we do a ls we can see that it's right here so, and then we could upload that again if we wanted to, to kind of restore the preset knobs. Here we can also uh, to um, get up. We can also save the profile knobs if we wanted to. And here you'd use the pro flag. So, and you can see that um, my profile is here. So, that it grabbed all my profile knobs and saved them to a profile file. So we could, you know, maybe we we're playing around with the fields or whatever and, and we wanted to go maybe go back to the way they were at some certain point. If you save a, if you save the knobs to a profile file, then you can easily do that. Alright, so we saw those. Let's move on.